What's going on guys? It, today is Friday. It is beautiful. It's like 70 degrees out. Today's a beautiful day to go hiking and I can go out and do kind of whatever I want. So it's about one o'clock. I decided to hit up Billy Goat Trail, um, which is a trail in Great Falls, Virginia. Um, known for some pretty rocky terrain and uh, you can kind of it's a little bit more advanced so i'm pretty pumped for that um, right now i'm walking along the towpath i'm just trying to get there but uh, i'm excited for what it should be like so uh that's going to be kind of our adventure for the day so hang in there with me so we're coming up to the entrance of the trail right about now this is the trailhead check that out taking this all the way around, it's 1.7 miles, and I'm gonna walk back along the path for another two miles to get back to where we parked, right there. Let's get it. A cicada shell, I believe. So it molted or died. Come here. A little bit of an update. <clears throat> I definitely ended up venturing off of the uh, the marked path and it's kind of nice out here if you can I'm in the middle of the woods ran into a few deer nice so it's kind of nice out here but I am very terrified of spiders and I have kept on I just keep on walking through spider webs and honestly I'm over it I love to be off the beaten path and exploring and all this stuff but when you walk through a bunch of spider webs everywhere kind of gets old after a little while um it's been about 20 minutes of me walking through the middle of nowhere off of the path and i finally just heard voices looked over and i saw through this clearing right here i saw a bunch of people walking through by a bunch, I mean two. Ah, oh, spider web. Ah. <sighs> oh, they're everywhere. There are so many spiders out here in the middle of the woods. I would not have gone hiking if I had known that there were spiders in the woods. What the heck? <sighs> you know this is Spider Alley right here. Like you just know that there's so many spiders. So, yeah, I do one of these things to make sure that all spider webs are out of the way and account. Oh my gosh! Like, look, look what I'm talking about here. I don't know if you can see that. Like, how am I supposed to walk through that? I can't. It's a big freaking spider. You know, this is quickly going to turn into... Oh. All right, I'm petrified. I'm stuck. There's so many spiders and I'm so stuck. You know what? I'm gonna climb this rock face. I'm gonna get up on top of here. Here. I'm gonna dodge all the spiders. That's definitely the move. We're, we're going with that. A little bit of life update. I'm back on the path. 
those were the rocks that I decided to climb through or climb up in order to, ouch, something's in my shoe, in order to get through all the spider webs without getting tagged. Still got a few, but I survived. So I came out on this trail, which is orange, when I've been, should have been following the blue markers. So, we made it. I'm alive. We're probably still like not even a quarter of the way through, so I've got a long way to go. But we're thriving. So I just learned a little fun fact. Apparently this is called Bear Island. Hopefully that means that, that doesn't mean that there's bears on it. But if so, who cares? Because we do it for the views. And when I say views, I mean views. Gotta make it all, all the way down here without dying or dropping my brand new phone. So, that's all. Foot crack here. Like walking these like cracks. Conquered that whole thing. It's off the bottom. It's well worth it for the view. I want a picnic right there. But look at this view. Just sheer cliffs, everything, everywhere, side to side. So we finished Billy Goat Trail, um, just popped out, and to walk across this little canal by going through this, uh, this bridge. Um, and now it's like a mile and a half walk back. Um, I could do it along the towpath, which is like literally just plain dirt and boring, or there's something called Burma Trail. Billy Goat Trail is about 1.7 miles, so not too long of a hike. Um, I would honestly, I thought it'd be a lot more difficult than it was. Um, yes, there's a lot of bouldering, a lot of climbing over big rocks and stuff like that. Um, but all in all, it like was not bad at all. Um, didn't take me that long either. So <clears throat> I would definitely recommend doing part A of Billy Goat Trail. But no, I had an absolute blast. It was a beautiful day to go hiking. Um, so now we're just gonna do kind of the, uh, the quick mile and a half walk back, get back to the car and call it a day. So. Not too bad. All right, we're coming up on the end here. Um, I'm about just about back to the car. Um, I'd like to do more of these. I don't, you know, I don't know how this turns out in post. Um, it could be very boring. It could be, you know, kind of lame. But uh, I kind of want to give it a shot. Um, but I had fun, so you know, I enjoyed doing it. I enjoyed the hike. Um, hiking alone isn't that bad, actually. You know, it's. I have a few friends that go hiking by themselves all the time and it's kind of refreshing to get out there and and just be kind of in nature by yourself and and enjoying it but uh yeah had a good hike um and uh hopefully i'll be doing this again sometime soon but uh thank you for hanging out um if you enjoyed this and would like to see more or like to see more of my other videos please check those out as well um but as always you know please if you enjoyed it hit that subscribe button and uh and drop it a like um, but yeah, I will uh, catch you guys on the next one. Peace.